It's Ben here, and here in this video, we're going to have a look at how we turn on one of the much awaited features in Final Cut Pro 10.7 the scrolling timeline. So, as you can see here, my timeline is still not scrolling, even though I've updated to the latest version of Final Cut Pro. To turn this on, we're going to come up to Final Cut Pro settings, and then we're going to come across to the playback settings, and then we're going to check this box scroll timeline continuously during playback. So, it is a choice that we have. We can turn it on and off depending on which one we prefer. And now you'll see that when I press play, beginning of my clip here, it doesn't start scrolling right away. When it comes to around the midpoint of the timeline, it will then start scrolling. So basically, depending on how far zoomed in you are on your timeline, so if we zoom in a bit more here, then you'll scroll as well. So you can see things whizzing by quite quickly there when we're super zoomed in. And this may be something you want to turn on or off depending on which part of your, your edit you're working on. So you can see when we zoomed out a little bit there, the playback is a little bit slower. And from what I've seen, the scrolling of the timeline works really well. You can zoom in and zoom out as you're playing back. So let's hit Shift and Z to come back to zoom to fit the timeline. And you'll see that as you're playing back here, you can still mark in and out points along the timeline, even when it's scrolling. So super useful feature for Final Cut Pro 10.7. Please do let me know if you have any questions about Final Cut Pro and I look forward to seeing you on the next video.